Hello, this is Smarter Prepping with Uncle Mark, and I'm Uncle Mark. Today is Wednesday, <clears throat> the 7th of February, 2024. The time is now about 15 minutes until 11, getting to be late at night. Okay. Oh, the last video I made, I showed you, by the way, first I've got to show you my outfit. And i got to say, hello, Isabella and Gabriella. I hey, like my new outfit. Yay, new overalls. Long story about these. It had to be altered two different ways. I'm not going to get into detail on that. Okay. I'm going to show you this bookcase over here. This one of my handmade, homemade bookcases that I made 40 years ago. See? Back here into the... See? That's setting up over there. And sometime in March... I plan to buy another one of these cube units and put it over here and then take this bookcase, handmade homemade bookcase, and move it over here next to this one. So I'll have two of these regular real wood ones over here. Aside from the other one that's over this way, I've got to do some improvements on that one. So I'm storing my water in half gallon mason jars. Okay? Prepper, you got to be ready. Half gallon mason jars of water, okay? filtered. I might buy a Berkey filter. That way I just filter my tap water instead of using the... I'm going to look into it, do a little research into it. Uh, you know, I go to the supermarket and they got a super duper filtration machine. I get that water, put it in the jars, or I could just use a Berkey filter. That might be good enough. Might be better. I don't know. All right. Now, last video I made, I showed you I was just getting started with this. Look at that. Look at that. See, that's pretty spiffy, I think. Come out from this angle, maybe. See? See the gray, the gray wood grain below, the chocolate wood grain above, see? That's to the left and to the right, see? And on the gray wood grain cube unit, it's, a lot, it's 12 plastic totes full of <coughs> food that I got for free. I need to get into the process of uh, getting dates on everything. Getting, I need to get everything marked with best of you, best if used by dates. I marked a couple of these. One that simply has no dates on there, and this one has dates of 2024, and it's now 2024. So you know, keep that in mind. We'll see how it all goes. This dried fruit doesn't have any dates. I got plums, figs, cranberries, and blueberries in there. Blueberries, super healthy health food. <clears throat> and then there's dried cherries. Like I say, I like to take dried fruit and put it in a saucepan, a little water, a little iodized salt, let it simmer a while. And you can eat like that or put it in with your oatmeal, make oatmeal fruit cookies, put it in your blender, make your fruit smoothie. Anyway, there's the canned meats, beef, pork, and salmon, and the canned chicken. Here's dried potatoes, dried mashed potatoes. Some applesauce I use to take my pills. Yeah, I use applesauce to take my pills. And so on and so forth. There's more, more stuff down there, but like I say, I'm going to... <sighs> but I just wanted to show you how I got this look, and then step back and look at the whole room, sort of, see? Oh, nice. Nice! Oh! See, that's a nice room. My brother-in-law encouraged me to talk about prepping. Well, part of prepping is you got to feel right. The whole point of prepping, prepping is so that in case you're short on this or short on that or some kind of you know, boil notice for the water or this and that, you're not going to be all freaked out and feeling miserable and depressed because you're having trouble getting over to buy some food or having trouble with the tap water because you're not having trouble. You have purified water on hand and you have food on hand. But that's real important part of keeping you happy. What's less important, but it's also part of just making you happy. And keep in mind, my wife died about two years ago. So I have to make myself happy to avoid depression. One of the biggest causes of death in America and the world is suicide, right? Suicide is one of the biggest causes of death. Way bigger than homicide. Follow me? Suicide in America, the rate is about 12 or so. 100,000 per year, 
homicide might be six or seven per hundred thousand per year. Okay. So you might be worried about the murder rate, but you need to think about the suicide rate. How do you avoid suicide? Avoid depression. How do you avoid depression? Feel good. <laughs> Am I feeling good? I'm looking at this room. Ah. Oh. I mean, you got to do all different things. But yes, you got the extra food, extra water over here, right? Oh, and you interact with family, friends, and neighbors. That's why I say, hello, Isabella and Gabriella. Interact with family, friends, and neighbors by putting out these YouTube videos. So see, that's what you do, right? You got to do these things. And I got to take my walk to keep myself physically healthy and strong. I got to pinch the pennies to keep myself financially healthy and strong. I'm going to do all the things I just said to keep myself emotionally healthy and strong. Avoid that depression. Right? Right. So that's the basics of prepping. There's a lot more things to know about prepping. People talk about uh, matches or something. I've got emergency lighting. I've got oil lamps. I've got flashlights. I've got like five flashlights, lots of batteries, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Lots of things to talk about with prepping. But the basic thing is you've got to feel right. So I'm going to give it up. I'm going to take one more look at this room. It's only six minutes in. Take one more look at this room. One more time. I hope that the, the YouTube allows this to be my thumbnail. Oh, I never know what it's going to choose for my thumbnails. Ah, oh, nice. See? And by the way, you got to eat from your prepper stash on a regular basis, seems to me. I'm going to do another video not too long from now. I'm going to take everything out of my deep freezer. Show you all. I did that once before. I'm going to do it again soon. Show you all the things I have stashed in my chest type freezer. Some things I bought. Some things people gave me. People gave me pistachios. My neighbors kept giving me free food. Pistachios. Anyway, I'll just have a minute then. I'll call it good. Okay. All right. I used to tell this whole story. I'm going to tell it again. Tanya, who died about two years ago. We were married for about 10 years, and she used to say, instead of saying, see you later, God, instead of saying, see you later, alligator, after a while, crocodile, she said, later, tater. So are you ready? Three, two, one. Later, tater. <laughs>